So, my style is a bit complicated, to say the least. For a very long time, I just followed the crowd, wore what was trending, and just kept it, kept it basic, basically. But recently, I have found my style, I have found what makes me happy, what I feel confident in, and it just makes me feel powerful. And that is the whimsy goth aesthetic. I found it thanks to TikTok. However, I kind of found it before TikTok. I just never knew what to call it. My style for about a half a year now has been inspired by Buffy the Vampire Slayer, Practical Magic, The Craft, Sabrina and, you know, Chilling Adventure of Sabrina, Sabrina the Teenage Witch, you know, all that kind of stuff. My style is just very 90s witch, but I'm also really into the hippie, bohemian, comfy, flowy kind of look and but then I also love the model off duty look. I love you know the Pinterest fall girl aesthetic as well but I would say my main style is whimsy goth. Now that I've discovered it, whimsy goth all the way. And if you don't know what whimsy goth is, is basically everything I just stated. It's very much Willow from Buffy and Buffy from Buffy, you know. These pictures here are inspirations. Um, Sabrina Spellman, love her outfits. Practical Magic, oh my god. And of course, we can't forget The Craft. Um, the Craft is just such a powerful movie, which just, the style, I love it. 90s witch, whimsy goth, it's my aesthetic, as well as bohemian hippie. Yeah. This fall, these are the pictures that are my just uh, inspiration so let's get started i have a lot of packages hey guys and welcome to today's video if you are new here hi hello my name is marnie welcome back um i said that completely wrong again i'm forgetting my own intro i haven't done a sit down video or a video where i talk one on one with you guys for a while but I'm getting back into the swing of things. I just started college again and everything's kind of been up in the air. Up in the air! <laughs> so I just want to thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers. I know to many it'll be like, oh, 200, that's not a lot compared to these people that have millions, thousands, whatever. However, this channel is something I've built from nothing and when you see something that you've built and created get appreciated and respected, it means the world. I know it doesn't matter about numbers, but to think I have 300 people that love and respect what I do and appreciate it, it means the world. So thank you guys so much for watching. But it is officially autumn, which is means I'm in my element. I am in my element. Um, I have bought a bunch of new clothes to unbox with you guys. I've been waiting for about two weeks for everything to come in because um, they all came in at different times. So the patience I had to have to not rip one of them open and just have a look what it looked like. Because I used, for this video, not sponsored, but maybe one day, I used an app called Vinted. Basically, I'm a Libra. I'm a shopaholic. It's how I deal with my emotions, really. I'm an Aquarius moon, so... <laughs> yeah, we're working on it, though. So, I'm a bit of a shopaholic. I will use any excuse to go shopping. I use an app called Vinted because I have fallen out of love with fast fashion. There's just too many negatives to it. Nothing ever seems to fit because the sizing nowadays is just not it. The sizing, if you're a little bit curvier, it's, it's not it. And even if the sizing is good, it's because the clothes are double the price of what they should be, and it's ridiculous. So, you could put that down to me having a bit of a style that maybe you wouldn't see as, in the shops as much as you would with like, model off duty aesthetic, or clean girl aesthetic, or all those different aesthetics, you know. I feel like everything in the shops nowadays are the same. The same cuts, the same styles, the same colours, and I'm bored of it. So bored of it. So, I use, I love going to charity shops. If you're from America, thrifted, I love thrifting. The clothes have so much love to them, you know, they've, they've lived a bit, and they kind of tell a story. And I just find, now that I know my style, 
I can go in a charity shop now and pick out five items easily but if I went to Primark right now I'd be like hmm I guess I could get another basic vest top like fast fashion isn't hitting the same so I have been obsessed and I mean obsessed Mariah Carey obsessed with vinted special place in my heart for that app so i have bought a bunch of new stuff from there and um, not new pre-loved stuff from there and new to me but pre-loved before all ready for autumn so i have some really exciting statement pieces and i just want to state i have no statement pieces in my wardrobe none none i have a favorite pair of jeans but that's about it my colour options in my wardrobe, very bland. Before I ramble on anymore, let me show you what I have got. Okay, first item. I have scribbled out my address, so don't even try. I have no idea. I have like five, six packages, and I have no idea what's in what. Obviously, I know what I've ordered, but they're all packaged individually, so it's going to be kind of like my birthday, Christmas. Um, this one has been ripped. But I promise I've not peeked inside, it's just the tape has come off, so I can promise you I've not looked inside. No idea what it is, but let's get started. So, I actually feel like it's my birthday. I feel like it's my birthday. It's not the colour I thought it would be, but it's it will do, it will do. They put it in bubble wrap, which is a really weird option to do for clothing, but I appreciate it. I have got this oversized sweater vest, which is actually the same colour I'm wearing today, which is... I thought it would be like a bit of a different shade of green, like a teal shade, but it's okay. It's very oversized, I didn't realise it would be that big. But this, layered with a black or white turtleneck, long sleeve turtleneck. Yes, yes, yes. These are my ideas, what I want to do with it, because Pinterest has also been my best friend. At this skirt, I don't know what it was, but I had so, the Vinted just didn't want me to get this skirt. It was the first item I purchased, but the last to get here. Um, this literally came today. Um, and for some reason, um, I Vinted said that it would be refunded me because apparently the woman didn't send the item, but she obviously did. So Vinted need to work on that with the woman but I've got the skirt this cute pattern so it's like a it's got purples, reds, pinks whites, blues so pretty with a pair of tights my, my platform boots and a white or black turtleneck again turtlenecks leather jackets, my leather jacket has the same kind of colours my inspiration again Chef's kiss. <laughs> this skirt I saw and I was sitting there for a good five minutes thinking, is this ugly or is this a cute aesthetic rare kind of piece that I won't probably see ever again? It's the whimsy goth aesthetic. It gave me timber and vibes. Um, it's a long maxi skirt, so cute, paired with platform boots and like a white vest top with like a sheer overthrow, very whimsy goth, 90s witch, you know what I mean. Now the colour scheme is kind of like a dark blue with light blue in there, yellow, we've got a bit of white, gorgeous, gorgeous pattern. Now the lady who I bought this from, I got this for about what, £4 maybe, and she never said it was brand new. But this brand new, 50 quid. This brand new, 50 quid, and it was on sale for 37. Brand new, 50 quid, on sale for 37. I got it for four quid. £4. I think it's gonna go really nice with my hair. I I think it's so cute. I'm sorry. I thought I was scared it was gonna be ugly. It's cute. It's cute. Don't 
say it otherwise. Next item. Now that skirt was the item I was most excited to get because I really wanted to make sure I liked it. <laughs> I'm excited to see what I can pair it with and all that jazz. I'm sorry if you can hear my family. I have a loud family, what can I say? This, oh my God, I'm so glad I opened this next. This I envisioned paired with this perfectly. I got it for like two quid. It's a jacket that ties in the middle, long sleeve, cropped, but this with a white vest top underneath, paired with this underneath. How cute! I'm sorry, what the hell? How cute! Hi. The inspiration for that outfit again. This, I can't show the front because it's got my dress on it. I can't actually remember what else I ordered. Oh, two dresses, two dresses. This is the pinafore um, style, you know, like the corduroy kind of dress. I've been wanting a black one of these for the longest time. This with an oversized graphic t-shirt underneath, a white turtleneck, um, a colour of like any sort underneath long sleeve t-shirt. It's a skirt one by the way, with I've got some really cute tights, I'll show you them too. Um, again with my platform boots for the autumn months. I'm gonna be like Sabrina the Teenage Witch. And, I recently bought a Pennywise graphic t-shirt um, and I was thinking, because it's so oversized, it will look so cute with one shoulder down and like half of it folded showing a bit of Pennywise outfit inspiration again Iconic This should be the other dress, if it's not, I ain't got a clue It is! Ah! First of all you're probably thinking, what the hell is that? I think I got this for two, three quid. Orange kind of velvety. This with a long sleeve turtle, black, black turtleneck underneath. Halloween goddess. I'm sorry, what the hell? Oh, cute tights. And again, my platform boots with my hair because I've recently dyed my hair. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay, my last item is I, in a little envelope and I did open it because I thought it was a letter from my college. It wasn't, it was this. I ordered this from Etsy, I will give a shout out to the page here. Um, really nice, sweet woman. Um, it's the Wabi Sabi Crystal Shop by Alexa. You can basically choose one to three crystals of your choice to put on a bracelet. I chose Labradorite for protection, intuition and self-discovery, red coral, healing, motivation and harmony, Unikai, insight, balance, detoxing, and it says thank you for supporting a small business. Here are the crystals. So there's Labradorite, red coral and Unikai. So gorgeous, it even matches. Yes. Oh, iconic. It's gonna be so cute on my wrist. Hopefully it fits. I do have very small wrists, so I'm thinking it might. I might be okay. Okay, then from the charity shop that I went to in person, thrifting, whatever you want to call it, I got this oversized silk black like button up. So I could use it as a jacket to throw over, like if I have a cute dress, cute vest top. It will look so cute paired with this. Oh, iconic. 350. Again, inspiration. The charity shop again I got, which is a red turtleneck because I thought it'd be so cute to go with the pinafore dress or just under anything. Because obviously layering is very important in these colder months. Red long sleeve turtleneck. Chef's kiss. Okay, so then a little while ago I did go to Primark, however I didn't find that much, I was a bit unimpressed. I just got basics from there, including this zip up kind of hoodie thing, which just gave me, you know, the full Bella Swan Twilight vibes. Can't go wrong. 
but this is what I'm so excited to layer. It's kind of like a half turtleneck, um, long sleeved bodysuit, white layer, perfect. Ah! Six pounds, I believe. I also got this two pack of claw clips. Um, I did get a dark blue one. However, it is in my college bag because I've been wearing it just literally religiously. Um, I have some polka dot tights, which are gonna look so cute later with some of the outfit ideas I have. Bought two makeup brushes because I need some. And this, I was really intrigued by. It's the PS Primox makeup brand. Overnight lip mask and lip oil. And you could get different ones. I got mine for sleep. There was like hydrating, exfoliating ones. £2.50 for the two. So I'm going to try those and get back to you on how well they work. That was it from Primark. And then again from the charity shops, I got... I've already worn to college because, oh, it was so comfy. It's a knitted, oversized, red, long-sleeved jumper. Very Sabrina Spellman. And this with a pinafore dress is going to look so cute. I then got this again with the pinafore dress, it will look so cute, or just laid with leggings, anything. It's a blue kind of dark navy, um, turtle shell cardigan, but it's like really thin, like see-through thin. Buttons are really cute and it's just going to be so cute for fall. And got a green long sleeve t-shirt oversized to layer again it gave me better swan vibes so i got it this layered with a white turtleneck would be so cute it's a ready burgundy kind of purple vest top with these like lacy jeweled bit on so cute just oh pack of opaque tights because tights you can't go wrong with in the colder month then also got these platform boots which i've been wearing at like my life depends on it they are the comfiest oh i just i have been dreaming about having platform boots for the longest damn time i finally got them finally got them and i love them with my whole heart um, and I'm so excited to pair all these outfits together and start wearing them. If you want to try on haul, please let me know because I have so many other items in my wardrobe you haven't seen yet that I want to pair with this stuff. And I can just do a massive try on haul, kind of like, mm. So if you want to see that, let me know because I would love to do that for you guys. Maybe I can inspire you for this autumn season. But, yeah. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. It means the world that I now have 200 subscribers. People that love and respect my work, it means the world. Like this video if you like my content and you want more fashion videos because I don't really do that many. Like the video if you also want to see a lookbook, a try on video, whatever you want. Um, and comment down below any video suggestions and celebration of 200 subscribers. Comment what video you found me on, with, whatever because I'd love to see it. Don't forget to subscribe so we can keep growing together because it really does mean the world, having a family to inspire one another. That's why I created and do what I do. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Love, peace, respect, and keep smiling. <laughs>